Hey everyone, I am Viola, the leader of Heartshot Dance, and that is my first time saying it that way, and I really gotta get used to that. So today I'm actually here to explain all of the new changes that we've made to Heartshot Dance. Um, as you've noticed, we have actually changed our name from Heartshot Project to Heartshot Dance, and um, there is a very various reasons why that's happened, um, but I'm actually gonna get into that just right now. So the first thing that you really need to know is that we've changed our uh, structure internally. Um, so basically the facets that were known as Heartshot Dance and Heartshot Arrows, they're not named anymore. So instead they're statuses or categories to which our members fall under. So instead of the two Heartshot Dance and Heartshot Arrows teams, there are now three statuses that have taken their place. So first off, there's an online only status, which means that you would only post to the YouTube channels if you were a member. And then there's also dual status, which essentially means that you go to conventions and participate in our group activities there, and you also post covers. Now, there's a third status now, um, which you know didn't really fall under the previous Hard Shot Dance or Hard Shot Arrows categories. Um, that is now a convention only status, which means that you only participate in group activities during conventions. And this would mean that you would participate in our group cover, you would participate in um, any kind of gatherings, or any kind of panels, or any you know performances that we're gonna have at the convention. So it kind of still makes us the dance group for everyone, um, but you know, kind of in a different kind of sense and caliber. So now the next thing you really need to know about is the voting process for our group covers, which used to be called our singles. Um, we're not just going to call it the singles anymore, but they're just going to be called group covers from now on. So now the group cover can be filmed at other conventions besides Katsukan and Otakon. Um, this gives us, you know, the flexibility to do other conventions as well as um, just those standard two. Now you will also be able to vote publicly, but the process to getting the songs is going to be just a little bit different. So at the end of the previous group cover, we'll have a suggestion list that's done internally so basically everyone in the group will suggest songs for us and then we will put them in a poll um, all of them and then the top three to five will be put in a public poll and then from there whatever song wins the public poll uh, will be the song that we do for that seasonal group dance another thing that we've changed internally is that now we have a very loose upload schedule so this means that we will be able to provide you with a little bit more content every week and hopefully that means that we'll be able to get um, a cover to you or a video like this uh, to you every week from now on every saturday lastly it's kind of minor but now all of our members have member colors um, before it was just simply people who did the conventions and covers but now across the board everyone has a member color now so if you're curious about what everyone's member color is, you can look at our About section on our YouTube channel. You can also look at our Facebook fan page's story to see all of those there, and they'll also be posted on our Tumblr on our member uh, info page. So if you're looking for a more complete and in-depth look at what has changed in our group, um, our new and complete group rules will be down in the description box, um, so you can check it out there, um, and they'll always be publicly available. So that should about cover it. I have been Viola, the leader of Hardshot Dance, and we hope, as always, for you to continue shooting for your dreams.